हेलो देख रहे सर हेलो मैम आई थिंक डेकर सर हैज नॉट जॉइंड हियर सो व्हाट टू डू शाल वी स्टार्ट द सेशन ओनली नो 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 वेट फॉर 5 मिनट्स बिकॉज़ पार्टिसिपेंट सेकंड सी स्टूडेंट्स आर स्टिल जॉइनिंग ओके ओके ठीक है हेलो हेलो मावड़े सर हेलो मैम हाँ व्हाट टू डू सर शाल वी स्टार्ट वैष्णवी आई थिंक वी शुड स्टार्ट बिकॉज़ वी आर लर्निंग आउट ऑफ़ टाइम या बिकॉज़ नेक्स्ट सेशन इज़ आल्सो देर ना 
ओके मैडम कुंड्रे मैम कल्याणी मैम शिखा मैम यस मैम हाँ सो विल स्टार्ट विद द नेक्स्ट सेशन गुड आफ्टरनून ऑल माई सेल्फ डॉक्टर प्राची वस्त फैकल्टी इन ई एन टी सी डिपार्टमेंट आई वेलकम यू ऑल इन द सेकेंड सेशन ऑफ इंडक्शन प्रोग्राम टॉपिक ऑफ द सेशन इज फिजिकल फिटनेस प्रमोशन टू स्पोर्ट्स कल्चरल एंड मैगजीन एक्टिविटीज uh to uh, discuss on this session we have uh, five speakers with us so i take an opportunity to uh, introduce uh, to uh, dr manisha kontre ma'am uh, dr Mani manisha kontre ma'am is uh, she is working as a physical director in assms coe for last 13 years her uh, under her guidance many students have participated and won many prizes in various sports secondly we have uh, mrs kalyani kulkarni ma'am from civil engineering department kalyani ma'am is our cultural in, in charge she has encouraged many student to participate uh, in cultural events like sirodia karandak purushottam karandak and many more third speaker of the session is uh, ms shikha pacholi ma'am from computer engineering Uh, she has been working as a uh, as a magazine in charge from last two years, and in this, she and her magazine team is determined to give students a proper stage for their creative skills. We also have with us uh, two T C students, uh, Miss Krutika Jagtap and Meghna Nagdiwe, who are going to share their experience of participation in competition of Firodia Karandak. Okay, thank you. Now I request uh, con uh, Dr. Manisha Kondre, ma'am, to start the session. Thank you, ma'am. Very good afternoon, everyone. Respected principal sir, Dr. D. S. Borumani sir, Dr. D. G. Bhalke sir, head of the department, my fellow colleagues and students. First, I would like to give thanks. to all for giving an opportunity to our department to speak to present our work i dr manisha kondre would like to start my session with sports and media and after that it will be followed by professor kalyani sant cultural in charge and by professor shikha pacholi magazine in charge कल्याणी मैम नेक्स्ट जिम खाना प्लेज एन रोल इम्पॉर्टेंट रोल फॉर द डेवलपमेंट ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स सो इट प्रोवाइड द प्लेटफॉर्म टू द स्टूडेंट्स इन द एरिया ऑफ कल्चरल स्पोर्ट्स मैगजीन एंड मेनी मोर एक्टिविटीज सो इट मोटिवेट्स एंड सपोर्ट द स्टूडेंट्स टू पार्टिसिपेट इन अ वेरियस एक्टिविटीज नेक्स्ट मैम the main objective uh, is that to help the students to create the platform to make the awareness and to help them to participate in the various programs it helps them to uh, make the different which uh, multi dimensional personalities is developed through the extra ex curricular activities and co curricular activities and it also provides a platform to the students for self realization they can excel or they can do good things in the future ma'am next next the various activities we conduct in our sports are like uh, ashwamedh uh, intercollegiate sports competition chhatrapati shivaji cricket trophy shaw football trophy and intercollegiate competition which is organized by the various colleges and it is also organized by not on behalf of kaitri bai phule university where many students of our college they participates in the competitions next in those competition we have a team games as well as uh, individual games for team games again we have boys and girls basketball volleyball kho kho kabaddi and many more the same thing individual also many students participate in shooting boxing 
Malakam Athletics and Cycling, where they are getting a bagging a good, uh, they are giving us a good result and helping us to showcase their talents. Next one. The few which we organize every year, uh, sports championship trophy, that is interdepartment competition. Mm -hmm. uh, every year we take competitions for the students and the last four to five years, we can see the results, see how the students from the different different uh, departments, they participate and uh, like last year, computer department, they have won the, um, the, I mean, the overall trophy, sports championship. Then last to last year was a mechanical. So these are the few glimpses where you can see the students are participating. So it's my appeal to the electrical electronics engineering department students to you participate in all the competition. It is always a platform for you to participate in the sports. See, from this interdepartment competition, we select the students for the intercollegiate. And where we see that he whether the student is from the first year, second year, or third year, we try to take the best student for in our team. That means we need a good team if in case we want to do a good, I mean, when we, whenever we want to do anything good, I mean, uh, have, want to have a good results, we need a proper team. And for that proper team, we conduct the interdepartment matches. And through this interdepartment matches, we select the students for our intercollegiate team. So it's my... Uh, appeal it's my uh, request to all the when the team, students of entc department to see that you participate uh, use maximum uh, participate in the maximum competition whatever is been organized in the department departmental level so that you will be in the uh, college team that is will be helpful for you to participate in the inter college year. next Uh, you can see the few, you know, glimpses like again uh, achievements from 2012 to 20. Uh, like shooting, we are having the national player. Uh, then CME football get a runner-up. Then Malkam also uh, Maskar. He was inter university player and he was the best, you know, Malkam player again. Aniket in 2017. And Summit is a winner, winner in that. Next. Few, again, we have these all the achievements where you can see the cricket is doing well because uh, maximum I have been observed that in the cricket, many students, they participate, they want to play only the cricket. Uh, it's my appeal, it's my request to all, the other than sports, I mean cricket, we have many other sports also. So you should participate in other sports, you should come forward, don't hesitate, don't say, Ki, gela kai hona mein, kon gena mein. you will find in every team, first year, second year and third year, all different classes students are there. We see the performance and select the students, not by the face. Or not by the Hama Jazawas and Nige. No, not in that way. Next one, please. Uh, next. Uh, Ma'am, uh, we have a media and marketing activity also with us. And uh, with that, we have uh, media may. Uh, these are the team. I mean, the we have committee, media committee. And Gormane sir, as a chairman, myself, Pacholi ma'am is there, Sneha Khedkar madam is there, then Merlin ma'am is there, Bosle sir, Pipe sir, DS Kulkarni, and NR Talar sir. So these are the committee, media and marketing committee, of, uh, committee members are there in staff. As well as we have the students committees also, but that with a huge number around 20. So we don't, I have not written here the media students name, but we require the maximum participation from the ENTC department also, because media is also one portfolio where we require the students. In the media, like we need, need an editor, video making, and so many other things. 
uh, first of all, what we do, what is the activities in the media and marketing is like, uh, uh, we have the website, then we do the online marketing, then we got a newspaper and magazine advertisement where we have to send the creatives, then education portfolio is there where we do educational online publicity, college event promotion, whatever in department, whatever event happens, we put on the social media that is on Facebook, Instagram, and on, as well as on the print media also. Then admission campaign means what we, we conduct the webinars and so many other things. Um, then we design the brands, brands in the future, like uh, we have a bags or some other, so many things which we published, we have to do the publicity through this of our college to the outside. Then next month. Then our like committee, sports, I mean the media students and faculties, they are responsible for the following activities like managing the social media pages on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Suppose the social, suppose the society media team for the internal branding, promotion of various college events for online and print uh, promotion, then promote the college through blogs, articles and videos helps the society media teams for preparation of news content for the press notes and various events and conduct uh, at the college. Training session with students for social media and promotion activities and support the society media team for online reputation management through the team of students. And our students, they manage the various uh, platforms in the college also. They do the internal publicity. They help to organize the various events. At present, we have started with a new, that is Coffee with Alumni, and one more is a Paramush. In these two events, the students, they in take part and they organize this event. It helps uh, us to have a con connect with the alumni and uh, Paramush, it helps to connect with the society. So these two committees, students and uh, teachers, they uh, combinedly work together to make the publicity of our college. Second, we have the uniform branding uh, like to display see on the Facebook and on social media, you will find this uh, logo. Wherever, whenever you find this logo means it is an official page. So it's my request to all, to those who are uh, liking the page or those who want to like the page or to uh, buy your friends, please tell them to this what is our, the, our official page and you just like this page and forward to everyone. Next month. Thank you. Thank you all. If any answer query, please ask. Or anything you want to ask a question, please ask. Okay. At the end, we'll take the question. Okay. I request uh, Kalyani Santa ma'am to uh, start with the, her session. Hello. Am I audible? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Clearly. Yeah. Uh, good afternoon to all present here. Uh, thank you, ENTC department, uh, HOD, Dr. Balke, sir, uh, entire coordinating team and organizing team of uh, uh, even uh, Dr. Vast, madam, uh, for this induction program, inviting me to share information of cultural committee. I, Kalyani Kulkarni, assistant professor mm -hmm. in civil engineering department and cultural activity coordinator, uh, take this opportunity to thank our college management for their encouragement and appreciation towards cultural activities uh, going all around the year. I would also like to thank Principal Dr. D.S. Bormani sir for constant motivation and support. Now I would like to start my presentation and uh, give you all an idea about uh, our committee. So um, cultural committee has uh, the main um, sticking to the vision of our institute, which states that uh, service to society through quality education. Uh, what is the real meaning of quality education is aptly followed by our institute by constantly encouraging students to showcase their talents through various co-curricular and extracurricular activities, along with balancing and excelling in curricular activities as well. So uh, when we talk about quality education, uh, we should establish an environment and culture which will encourage students to participate in extracurricular activities comprising various competitions, events, programs, which will bring out the best 
of the students and help them learn multitasking through seeking a balance between co-curricular and extracurricular activity. AISSM Society beholds a strong heritage and cultural roots through its establishment and through years it has proven its excellence in not just academics but sports and other activities with large number of students participating every year and receiving critical acclaim and various awards. Uh, under cultural committee, uh, events like Purushottam Karandak, Vinodottam Karandak, Firodia Karandak, Vedant Karandak, Daji Kaka Gadgir Karandak and other inter-college competitions are carried out uh, throughout the year and we have uh, enormous participation through self-motivation and through our encouragement also. A lot of students participate every year. This is to bring out the best from the students at college level uh, also through annual cultural events like uh, Ashwamid, which is a balance of sports and uh, cultural activities and Shivanjali, which is our annual gathering every year uh, in which students participate to showcase their individual and group talents. Objectives of our committee uh, to inculcate conducive atmosphere among students to portray talent in various extracurricular activities to encourage maximum participation in various events and competitions to help in developing qualities like team building, leadership and talent display, to aim for excellence by winning maximum awards and recognition through various inter-college, state and national level competitions. Functions of our committee, creating awareness about planned annual events to encourage maximum participation from uh, right from first year engineering uh, students, planning of various events and forming various teams to participate in the events taking place simultaneously. And we'll, uh, we also work out the pro program semester-wise to uh, clearly make a plan and uh, giving opportunity to each and every student who aspires to display his or her talent. So uh, it is um, particularly seen that uh, each and every student who is interested to showcase uh, his or her talent gets an equal opportunity to uh, display his skills. Uh, and we also plan events like Ashwamid and Shivanjali, which are annual events every year they are planned. Uh, but each year we have an innovative style. We have some themes you people might have seen last year. The theme was Marathi culture. So every year we try to uh, build atmosphere and we try to create certain themes to create enthusiasm and uh, excitement in the students. Uh, this is almost a five day or a week long activity with two to three days for Ashwamed and two days for Shivanjali. So one whole week, the students are given a uh, full opportunity, full time opportunity to display their um, sports, cultural and other talents. Uh, it is in the uh, second semester in the first or second week of February. Additional activities uh, taken under cultural uh, committee are interdepartment competitions. Uh, these were conducted first time uh, last year uh, under various uh, talent sections like singing, acting, solo dancing, instrumental, poetry, and storytelling. This is to identify the talent of uh, students at early stage and we encourage more participation from first and second year students so that they get more opportunity. They have two to three more years in hand to uh, get sufficient exposure and uh, uh, get uh, atmosphere to display their talent. And then we also had a separate talent hunt arranged for FE students last year. Uh, it was basically for team building and uh, preparing a new team for uh, Firodia Karandak and Shivanjali Ashwamit. Uh, these are some of the major achievements in 2019-20. Uh, we got first prize in Vinodottam Karandak, uh, which took place in September 2nd week 2019. Uh, we had uh, three uh, main uh, le leads in this play. Uh, we also got best actor, best actress, best play, first prize, best direction and screenplay and best supporting actor. This was followed in third week of September by Bharat Karandak, same play we had displayed and uh, we got consolation prize for best actress. Then we had Daji Kaka Gadgir Karandak, which was in first week of October. Again, uh, we got consolation prize for best actress, best actor. Then we had IIT Kharagpur uh, uh, Spring Fest, which had uh, featuring Arya Polos from uh, electrical department, solo dance, uh, and she qualified for a solo dance competition. 
then we had impressions 2019 again uh, solo dance competition which was in december and uh, she qualified through primary round also these are some of the highlights and special achievements in 2019-20 our play bay ke bay uh, select was selected in top 20 plays to be displayed as a commercial play uh, and it had uh, shows from 10th to 25th january 2020 under the head natya sattak so it was actually uh, shown like a commercial play uh, in renowned uh, theatres. Uh, then we had qualified uh, for uh, final round in top 10 plays of Firodia Karandak, uh, which was the first time that we had qualified for this round. Uh, and we stood fifth in the final round with following prizes. We got uh, third prize in best shadow play and UV act. First prize in best background uh, score, third prize in best group dance, first prize in uh, bass guitar, first prize in main guitar, third prize for non-conventional art 3D miniature and consolation prize for best music piece. And um, uh, we were uh, very much appreciated critically also and uh, we got a lot of appreciation from our college management, our secretary. Honorable Secretary uh, Shri Maloji Rajat Chhatrapati and our Joint Secretary uh, Shri S.P. Shinde sir personally contacted our participants and uh, congratulated them for uh, their performances. So, uh, in all, we have a lot of encouragement uh, in co-curricular and extracurricular activities also. And uh, our students have taught in this field also. I would also like to say uh, that we have continued our activities in the lockdown period also uh, by uh, carrying out one activity which was a simple talent uh, showcase activity at our college level only and which was followed by uh, one more activity named Unlock 2020 which had inter-college and inter-university participations. We had more than 500 participants uh, registering and showcasing their talents under uh, various heads like dancing, music, acting, etc. And it was open to all, actually, not just students, even other uh, faculty members from other colleges also have participated and we got a humongous response from all of them. Uh, we have also released a video compilation of the best activities of all the best performers under each head and we have issued certificate of participation to all the participants. So, uh, we have basically encouraged uh, the students even while sitting at home to display their talents and um, uh, gave them an, gave them a platform for the same. Uh, before ending my presentation, I would just like to add one thing that uh, nowadays or today's world requires um, jack of all trades rather than master of one trade. So uh, if you excel in all the activities and if you balance and successfully come out as a good uh, graduate, then you will definitely uh, make all of us and yourself and your family proud of you. Thank you. Thank you, Kalyani, ma'am. Uh, now I request uh, Shikha, ma'am. Hello. Uh, ma'am, I'm trying to share my screen, but I'm not able to share. Okay, I'll, I'll try, ma'am. Okay. Ma'am, first, uh, Kalyani ma'am, if she'll stop the screen. Yes, uh, Kalyani ma'am. Uh, yeah, yeah, I have, yeah, I have stopped it. It's just taking some time. I've stopped sharing. Yeah, now you can share. Okay. Okay. So, am I audible? Yes, yes ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Uh, should I start, ma'am? Ma'am, just do it. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Go to and presentation. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So very good afternoon to all of you, respected principal, sir. Uh, HOD ENTC department, Dr. Bhalke, sir. Dr. Mavle, sir. Uh, Prachi Vas, ma'am, all the coordinators of event and to the lovely student. First of all, I'm very happy and I'm very thankful to all of you that you have given me an opportunity to share myself with these brilliant minds. As it is said, 
positive minds are most powerful minds so we in aissms coe aims to provide a overall personality development of students and it includes sports culture and other artistic pursuit of the student as ma'am kondre uh, uh, ma'am and kalyani ma'am has rightly explained all of the details of their committee myself shikha pachuli i am assistant professor of computer engineering department i am the magazine in charge of aissms coe and i would like to share you uh, there is voice इन अवर कॉलेज वी एक्चुअली एम फॉर द ओवरऑल पर्सनैलिटी डेवलपमेंट ऑफ द स्टूडेंट it it includes sports it includes cultural activity and there are some introvert student who are not uh, very extrovert and who are not actually very uh, uh, they are not able to express themselves through various activities for them uh, there is magazine where they can portray their inner artistic uh, things or uh, the creative minds of theirs through our magazine so the name of our magazine is shiv darpan as you can see in the presentation Uh, the slide is visible to all yes ma'am the tagline yes. of our magazine is shabdanche ami shabdsha shabdsha it means we are literacy emperors of word i am the magazine in charge shivdarpan is the name of magazine committee or the tagline as i said it means tagline tagline is shabdanche ami shabdsha shabdsha it means we are the literary emperor of the word so i'll tell you about the magazine our magazine has five main section there is a marathi section english hindi art alumni and recently foreign language section has been also added uh, what we do basically in magazine we uh, try to capture all the activities of whole year from various departments by faculty by students then there are interviews of eminent personalities that are integral part of our magazine these eminent personalities are selected by our students only the committee of students only then all the yearly achievement of our college as well as every department are included uh, and uh, we have been publishing the annual college magazine from last 19 years it is created and designed by students along with the guidance of faculty members the annual magazine is published by the students committee every year for at least 5 years successfully and has been published for total of 18 times the magazine consists of article poems written by students and faculty of aissms coe the blogs the various uh, interviews they are also part of the magazine it also displays the achievement of that specific year either they are college level uh, achievements or any individual ach uh, achievement we try to take it all in form of one annual magazine and uh, recently uh, the 17th edition of our college magazine hridayam uh, it stood second in the state level competition organized by g disha hridayam also secured the title of second best professional college magazine in a magazine competition arranged by sppu so there are various awards accolades other than you are uh, having an opportunity to uh bring out the creativity in you it actually motivates you in a very positive manner also and uh, here i would like to thank again principal sir all the departments and head all the department faculty and last but not the least our management honorary secretary uh, maloji raje sir uh, joint secretary suresh sindeshar and all the management uh, different people as uh, our management is very very uh, helpful and they provide a lot of help in doing all the academic activities and as well as all the curricular activities because that is uh, very very important as kalyani ma'am has rightly said uh, today is the era where you have to actually uh, you have to basically be active in so many uh, different areas of your life and creativity hones your skill either they are uh, technical skills or they are professional skills if you have a creative mind it will help you go in a long way so these are my views and uh, these are various events uh, which magazine committees has uh, have conduct have been conducting the most awaited art event of the year art trivial 
it is also organized by us where various art forms like paintings sketches crafts etc of students and teachers are exhibited yuva vani uh, that is another event which we are organizing from uh, our magazine committee it is a sub platform under the banner of shivdarpan where student get a chance to meet and interact with some of the distinguished personalities in the field of art and literature and we try to uh, sometimes we call authors of the book Uh, then sometimes we call the people who are willing to interact with students and they are giving a different perspective about life about literature about uh, everything to the student so it is like one to one interaction so that is one thing then surbhi is a wall magazine of the college it is a mini platform to showcase writings and paintings then uh, there are two events in ashwamedh which is our annual sports event pen it down and poetry event it is also conducted by the magazine committee okay this is the working team of uh, 1920 and as you can see uh, the magazine committees has included the students from all the branches mechanical computer entc and this team is uh, doing a very good work so this is the team thank you so basically this was all about the magazine thank you ma'am thank you so much ma'am mm -hmm. thank you thank you uh, krutika jagtap meghna yes, ma'am Ah yes. Are you ready? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. So you can share your experience with the students. Okay. So over to you, Pratika. Okay, ma'am. Okay, okay ma'am. A very good afternoon to our respected teachers and my dear friends, and also huge welcome to our second year students. Uh, so me myself, Pratika and Meghna, we are the part of cultural team, and uh, already. Uh, Uh, Kalyani ma'am has introduced us to the cultural uh, activity, how it coordinates and how it works overall. So I'll just share my personal view on how it works. Hello. You are audible. Hello, Kritika. You are audible. Hello, ma'am. Yeah, yeah. You can continue. Hello. 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 You can continue, Krutika. You are audible. Mm -hmm. Hello. 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 Maude sir. Hello. Ha ah, yes, Krutika. Can you hear me? Hello. Mm -hmm. Hello, ma'am. Krutika is having some problem. We'll uh, first ask Meghna to share her views. Then Krutika yeah. can. Hello. Whether Meghna? Yeah, Krutika. Meghna. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. I think Krutika is having some problem. Oh uh, yes, yes. So you can talk. Yeah. So Kalyani ma'am has already informed us uh, that how it works and all. so uh to showcase our talents we participate in many competitions like vinodattam rajika ka purushottam bharat karandak which is based purely on acting last last to last year we have achieved second prize and last year we have achieved first prize in vinodattam karandak for a comedy play uh and many individual prizes also apart from this we have our uh, dance group and music band also which participate in many intergraduate call many intercollegiate competitions and we have also achieved prizes uh, we have a competition called sirodia combining all this art forms like dance music acting stand art radio art culture painting shadow art miniature Uh, so Firodia is a platform to perform live movie on stage. Um, means all the art forms are in forty-five minutes uh, by portraying a storyline. This year we have performed a play on the ups and downs in the relationship of father and son. So it was a comedy play. Hmm. 
we who performed and choreographed three dances in play music band was there to give live music and also they have given background music to it uh, through miniature we have portrayed the daily routine of the sun through the uv act which was the best uh, they have portrayed the father father who is trying to become cool or trying to reduce the generation gap we have also used vfx to support it then through sand art we have expressed the memories of father and son also the paintings fire painting sculpture thread art were there to support the play many of our seniors have supported us a lot all these things are performed us in 45 minutes live and we have made our position in top 9 among 60 plus colleges uh, all over the pune actually the process of virodia is fun it teaches us a lot uh, because everything is done by students from designing a set construction of a story uh, to making props we play many of the games to increase team bonding coordination to improve our um, to improve ourselves all these things help us to face the stage help us to become a multitasker it increases our team bonding and also help us to develop our personality extra curricular is also important supporting our academics it helps us to improve as an individual um uh, and also uh, faculty members have support us um uh, we have no issues for attendance and also megna we would want like to share that this year it was the cherry on the cake type of thing because after 5 years we were uh, in the top 9 in the uh, finals of pirodia because yeah after all the hard work and the efforts we put in throughout we were in the top 9 and also we worked as a team there is no senior and junior uh, we always we are always uh, through thick and thin so uh, also we get a platform uh, to uh, in to also build our leadership qualities as uh, kalyani ma'am said we have many competitions such as interdepartment firodia vinodattam and many competitions take place and also we have bagged many prizes from our department uh, our department has many achievements in cultural as well as sports and we have a uh, humongous uh, support from a hod a faculty member uh, from our principal sir and bosley sir and kalyani ma'am she uh, make sure that uh, everything is uh, going smooth throughout the process she was very helpful and what bothers most like uh, what bothers us is that about the attendance and the academics so apart from academics also this is important for us for it only not only grow we don't only grow as in our uh, field of interest but we also grow as a person we learn many things from this uh, entire process so yeah and also and if you are interested in our uh, experience yeah and if you are interested in any of this art forms or you have your own creative ideas or you want to learn any of these things you are always welcome you cannot contact us and thank you for giving us chance to share our words okay hello yes ma'am megna okay um, Can you hear me? So I would like to thank uh, Dr. Pandre, uh, the Kalyani Santa Madam, and uh, Shikha Pachauli Madam for uh, guiding and motivating students uh, so that they are going to definitely participate in various activities. Thank you, ma'am, for sharing your valuable time with us. 
students if you have any question please put it in chat box okay uh, shall we conclude with this session yes yes ma'am okay we'll proceed for the next okay so thank you all for listening patiently to this session with the next session uh Bagmare sir Hello Bagmare sir Ah uh, yes I am ready Yeah okay Vismita ma'am Vismita ma'am Hello Yes sir Bagmare sir has joined Yes sir yes sir he is there so i'll uh, start with the session yes ma'am yes ma'am
Uh, shall we start? Yes, sir. Just one second. Okay. So uh, now we uh, start with the second section. So now in the second afternoon session, uh, the topic of the session is CITP support for the student. Uh, training and placement cell plays vital role in student life as it helps you all to place in your dream company. So to guide you all in this aspect, we have with us the head of the CITP cell, Dr. Avinash Vagmare, sir, from Mechanical Engineering Department. Uh, also, we have with us uh, uh, Professor Vismita Nagrade, madam, uh, assistant professor in uh, ENTC department. She is working as a co coordinator of CITP, a departmental coordinator of CITP cell. Okay. Thank you, Vagmare, sir, for accepting our invitation. So I request you to start the session. Uh, thank you, ma'am. Only the uh, question will be that my presentation will be like this or somewhere in a different form. Okay, sir. Okay, okay since uh, I have to share a few uh, points uh, and then uh, directly on the browser as well. So it's uh, the combination of my presentation uh, plus the information and what will be the process of uh, reaching to uh, CITP. So I would like to uh, thank uh, ENTC department for inviting me uh, uh, to address uh, students of ENTC. As per my knowledge, uh, these are second year, third year and then the final year students. Is it right? Hello? Hello? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. These are the second year, third year, and final year students. Yes, right? sir. Yes, sir. So, uh, my uh, uh, approach uh, should be not only towards the final year students, but the second year as well. Since second year students are not directly connected to CITP. First year, second year, and third year. And in the third year half, second half only starts to connect to CITP. So my um, presentation uh, will be starting on the title itself, the CITP is the Center for Information Training and Placement. Most of the students are not aware about it. They know only the placements, but the placements uh, is done uh, in the cell, in the center, Center for Information Training and Placement. It's the CIT, I'm, I'm getting the, Center for Information Training and Placement. The agenda of my presentation is the introduction of CITP, the faculty student coordinators, website for placement, LinkedIn, Telegram, WhatsApp, Facebook, any other social media that is required to students, professional body memberships, and then the committees associated with CITP. Now, uh, here, Now the introduction in the uh, introduction of CITP, CITP is the center, which comprises of which comprises of all these committees. Uh, those are the placements, trainings, industry institute interaction, alumni competitive examinations, entrepreneurship and skill development training uh, trainings that I mentioned here. And these committees are heading by the placement that is by the training placement officer. Right now, I'm looking after this so the whoever is in need of this uh, training placement uh, about the placements, they can directly contact me. Even uh, for the internships, it is obvious that they will come through the department. Then the Industry Institute Interaction, which is headed by Dr. C.S. Saudari, alumni engagements. Dr. D. V. K. Barker, competitive examinations, Professor D. Y. Kaji, entrepreneurship and uh, skills development, Professor S. N. Chivande, trainings, Kongshisar, counseling and mentoring, Professor S. L. Linge. Uh, here we know that, just a minute, uh, here we know that the students' employment, self employment, and higher education requires proper training. 
and support of industry institute and alumni here we basically concentrate on the employment and self employment and in the higher education and then the ultimately the, the employability that leads to all these things we come basically bifurcate or the student who is leaving the institution either he will be going for the employment whether it will be in the government organization or in the corporate sector or for the self employment uh, in this and the second category is then is in the self employment and third will be is the higher education so the student who is leaving of the institution will be either of these three which requires proper training and support of industry institute and alumni so institute has formed relevant committees so those are the trainings committee as i mentioned here placements committee counseling and mentoring committee industry institute interaction committee entrepreneurship and skills development committee alumni and then the competitive examinations it requires coordination and then the citp is doing this coordination and we have seen that this is the the one uh this is the one uh, group of them. now citp what citp does citp conducts programs in the areas of career planning personality development entrepreneurship uh, development etc it also provides guidance to the students aspiring for higher education in india and abroad and even organizes special lectures to know various job opportunities in special fields such as the military air force or the uh, merchant navy these are the special areas where uh, normally uh, this information is not uh, available outside anywhere now it's a uh, uh, regarding the uh, trainings the trainings uh, are of for different types where we cater technical that is normally 80 90% trainings are given it uh, says uh, from first year to last year technical information technical trainings are given which is the formal later on the aptitude training is required which is not in our curriculum which needs special attention the aptitude is required almost in all it based companies and even the core company they also ask for the aptitude programming languages most secondary branches but nowadays even the core branches such as technical civil those are also uh, asked for these students are also moving towards it base so they also need the programming uh, language group discussion which is common in both type of uh, placements interview techniques which uh, have been required english language and communication and virtual platforms this has been newly introduced uh, uh, since which was not there earlier but the virtual platform and that awareness is required since nowadays after pandemic situation we uh, now consider it as a post covid situation and all all of you those are now though those are in the b final year they will be also in the post covid uh, situation so they will be also uh, uh, they should also know virtual platforms what are the virtual platforms and they should be very well acquainted with the virtual platforms and no question of the third year and then the second year students so you must be aware of the virtual platforms and we all of us have adopted it since all of we are there on the virtual platform and it is uh, obvious that the uh, we are there and that will be the one of the kind of training now what the placements the placements are of two types those are the core uh, companies and it based company these companies there are drives normally such as the tcs or infosys or the cognizant or the such such are the it based companies or uh, so they come and or there are the campus placements but in core companies normally it is done through the direct links or uh, such as through the very good relationship with the our institution and the industry so there the placement is done normally where the pre placement the procedure of this is the pre placement almost in all companies all placements the pre placement so earlier it was being done at the institute but the in post covid situation it will not may not be there since the uh, industry will not be in a position to come over here and then the uh, 
uh, introduce themselves. But instead of that, there are various uh, good platforms, virtual platforms directly from there. They will be directly interacting with you, with all, all of your students, and they will tell you about that, what we are. What are their uh, products? Uh, how the, is that organization? What are the job prospects in that company? So that point of view, they give info, information. And then only we decide, the students decide that, yes, it's uh, uh, that company suitable to me or not. And then the student either go forward or that leaves over there itself. After that, there are the online or the offline tests. Normally nowadays, there, those are the online tests and I don't think there will be the offline test henceforth. But the, these are the tests and where the filtration is normally done. So out of 100, normally 20, 30, 30 35 students only go through the these online uh, tests where your technical or your uh, other aptitude kind of tests are done then after that the few students are remained only so they will be asked uh, to appear for the group discussions so we have to be very well uh, acquainted with the group discussions uh, and where though we say that the language is not important their content is important but as per my view the language is also important so language plus your communication that is very very important in group discussion interview techniques and those are the interviews of the hr interviews and the technical interview i would suggest here to go for virtual platforms there are various courses in coursera or in uh, there are various uh, courses uh, has been um, expo given to you by the institution please go through those and start working on it so that the, you will get uh, free of such courses right now uh, within a month only. I think up to 15th of July, uh, those are the free courses on the Coursera. So please uh, and uh, please uh, enroll to those courses. So all these things are available, but you have to be uh, ready for this. Uh, then this, another section is the counseling and mentoring. So we have very well set procedure of mentoring mentor mentee uh, those are the second year they also know that the it was there in first year and second third year fourth year students so they are very well known about it but henceforth this mentoring process will be also online now here the groups will be made on microsoft team that group will be the or the group or the team will be organized by the, your mentor and mentor will uh, join or the mentees will join to that group and there will be the starting of the discussions. Now where there you can do chatting, there you can have the meetings, there you can have uh, your questions. So it is very well uh, be available with you. There is a difference between the counseling and mentoring. The mentoring is the very well set process and it is one to one mentoring is expected at our institute and you should be also directly in touch with the mentor. The second is the counseling. Counseling is done uh, by the internal faculty and by professional counselors. Professional counselors, first of all, we try to uh, counsel at our level. If it is a basic thing, basic issue, then th that can be sorted out at our level. But if the, the um, the issue is at some some of higher level then we direct the student to the uh, professional counselor and we have the professional counselor signed many of you must be known about the professional counselor if it is not known then you can even ask to the department person uh, or to us there are also the um, uh, this mentor uh, coordinator i think at your uh, place uh, itkarkar madam is there Now here, industry institute interaction, we have uh, one faculty, one industry through which we are trying to build relations with industry and directly know any industry directly come, uh, comes to us for uh, placements. So when we have very good licensing, then and then only the industry comes over here or they, uh, they give us, uh, they give us uh, extension or the, they allow us to uh, for the placements. Uh, we have the uh, yeah, we have done many MOUs with the industries at the ENTC department. Also, there are various uh, more than 10 MOUs have been done. 
so the in department is directly in touch with the uh, industry where the uh, under the heading of the industry institute interaction this is one of the committee where we do the visits where we do expert lectures uh, through which also uh, the licensing is uh, done or the uh, the bonding is uh, bonding with the in the in industries also done where we do projects while doing projects most of the students are getting absorbed in the industry so we also prefer to uh, give projects one year projects uh, in the industry so that the students also get uh, get acquainted with the processes in industry and uh, when they work over there similar kind of work they can extend in the industry so this is a very good uh, platform or through the link uh, where we can uh, be placed then the consultancy or joint work actually it is not in your hand but the consultancy is normally done at the department level joint works are also there where the there are links with the industry and this is the very good uh, way to getting placed in industry now here entrepreneurship and skill development it is one another uh, committee which comes under the citp where there are uh, many many schemes launched by the central government and then the uh, state ministries where we are not aware but this committee only takes you to the, those schemes or government agencies are also there at the same time there are many many uh, such schemes of the mncs or the uh, big industries those schemes are also can be adopted and uh, we can work on it uh, entrepreneurship is also the main motto of the entrepreneurship and skill development uh, committee and training programs for the skills development in the last semester semester only we conducted uh, jointly programs with the uh, i am amdavad so there were three courses so three uh, big uh, short term programs out of the, uh, those three two were successful and then the one uh, could not be done uh, because of the uh, because of this uh, pandemic situation only uh a competitive examination many students go for the competitive examinations where the support uh, for mpsc upsc and ias is required even there are other uh, such as the rtos and all these where the support is required where we are also uh, supporting and gate preparation gate all the students must appear here uh, for gate examinations and second year students should start working on it the first of all at least go through the syllabus of the gate examination and start working on it there are many uh, many uh, subjects or the courses those are uh, many courses those are directly uh, i use uh, many courses those are there in the gate uh, preparation now here i would like to show uh, now how the functioning is done at the citp at the citp uh, there are coordinators final year coordinator third year coordinator and i am also thinking the coordinator to be taken from the second year so second years will not work second year will simply see that the what are the working uh, what are the activities uh, in uh, citp third year students they will be supporting to drive and uh, the at the time of execution but the final year students they are directly involved in the placements mostly for the placement these are the coordinators will be working and uh, we have the faculty coordinators uh, the all the departments are having the faculty coordinators for the citp uh, and at your at the entc uh, nagrale madam yes nagrale madam is the coordinator and these are the students this is a final year student this is a third year student and two two students per division are taken so that they will be uh, actually our communication is through these students so that communication uh, is through uh, here whatsapp this whatsapp group is citp coordinators 2021 can you see it hello hello yes sir uh, can you see this screen yeah competitive examination yes, sir 
वन मिनट हाँ शेयर स्क्रीन तो बेर हाँ यस नाउ यस सर व्हाट्सएप व्हाट्सएप ग्रुप यस सर इट इज विजिबल यस सो दिस द ग्रुप ऑफ सीआईटीपी कोऑर्डिनेटर्स 2021 नाउ बेर देर आर टू स्टूडेंट्स फ्रॉम योर डिपार्टमेंट दो हजार तो फाइनल ईयर स्टूडेंट्स एंड व्हाट एवर द प्लेसमेंट रिलेटेड or employability related uh, information i share it with uh, these students so here is the group second group is the telegram group purposefully i am not showing this complete here the link now uh, this group is made for the people who are or were or will be associated with cidp where they are concerned with employability or higher education or placements and career development aspects and for the communication information and so on here need not to join every uh, everyone so but only those are concerned with the employability or the serious about the employability or the career aspects they simply they will only join uh, join to this group that group is given here uh, this is shared with your final year students uh, the not final year student these are the shared with the coordinators it is a telegram group and uh, you please join to this if you are really interested in the employability aspects information because we need uh, the schemes of government schemes of or the where the industry is going what is the situation of the industry and where will be the possibility of uh, generation of employability uh, employment so such kind of information i am sharing over here even the students also can share information here other information is strictly uh, avoided so this is about the telegram group uh, the second is you should join linkedin account first of all create linkedin account so from it is my appeal it is sincere appeal to all students though it is second year or final year or third year first of all you join to linkedin since it is a one official and having uh, mostly the business communications or the professional communications so please join to linkedin and then only to citp so that the citp information will be um, uh, obtained here and uh, then uh i'll not suggest you to go for the social uh, networkings and all this since uh, i cannot appeal to you about it okay now uh, coming to one minute coming to our uh, presentation okay now here i have told you about i told you about the yeah, can you see my presentation right now yes sir yes, yes sir so i told you about the linkedin i told you about the uh, joining to linkedin joining to telegram joining to whatsapp and then these are optional facebook and or any other special social media is optional but i uh, separate it out linkedin all students must be there on linkedin all students must be there please remember this so at any point of time i ask to any student that have joined linkedin they should be there on the linkedin and after that only the after the in the third year or the final year you can join to citp by the time before to that is not necessary telegram where those who are mainly concerned with the employability or the employment uh, or about the business strategies and all this they only will join to the telegram group whatsapp group only the coordinators those are the final year coordinator will be having the third year coordinator will be also having the second year coordinator second year coordinators are not that much important right now but the third year and then the final year coordinator and these names uh, normally we take from the department it is through the faculty coordinator so nagarale madam will give us those names Uh, names only final year names are with me right now, but the third year names are not taken. 
and Facebook and all these that I will not uh, mention in thing. So now here, uh, when I go back to the agenda where we have talked about the faculty student coordinators, where we have seen that the what is the structure of the CIT, where we have seen that the uh, social media and all these groups. I'll uh, extend my presentation to the professional body membership. Now here, professional bodies and in ENTC, there are professional bodies. Those are the professional bodies or the clubs. So the drone clubs, robotic clubs, then IEEE uh, is the professional body. IST is the professional body. Institution of Engineers is the professional body. Must be more than these. These are the number of professional bodies. You join any one of these professional body. The reason is that there you will be in touch with the industry people. There you will be in touch with the uh, salesperson of that particular field. There you will be in touch with the, the community where you like to work. Such as sometimes the, you, you must be uh, working in the embedded systems or uh, somewhere. So those kind of uh, professional bodies are there and you join to this. So where there is no difference between the researcher, businessman, student or engineer or anything. All those, all these people, they come together with the same passion under the one umbrella only. So please join these professional bodies where you will be, in, uh, your network will be uh, enhanced when you join to professional bodies and at the same time you get also platforms to work uh, as a leader you will work as a executives and where our skills are enhanced so professional body membership is very much important while leaving the institution you should be very well uh, uh, prepared for either the placements or for the self-employment or for even the higher studies and even in higher studies, these things are asked. And when you are very strong or very good in such activities, then there is a possibility of getting the teaching assistancy for the research assistantships, uh, 25%, 50%, or even I saw that the 75 to 100% uh, research assistantships or the, uh, so that also, that is also the earning. A committee is associated with CITB, that also I mentioned. Now here I would like to mention the one major thing is that the AISSMSCOE placementswordpress.com. Now I'll go to the, I'll go to one minute. Ah, yes, uh, this is the website. Uh, I, I think uh, you cannot see this website. Eh? My presentation and from presentation, I let to go to uh, uh, slide share and CITP presentation. One minute. Uh, here uh, websites. Uh, here uh, you are there on presentation right now. Yes, sir. Uh, and uh, can you see browser? No, sir. No. Okay. One minute. I am connecting it to a website. Okay, sir. No issue. Yes, now this was looking uh, like uh, text only. Now it is CITP website, isn't it? Yes, sir. Ah, now this website is the SSMS replacement dot WordPress dot com. The domain name is not taken. Uh, but uh, here, uh, this website will be linked to our main website, where the, it's all about the CITP and all these uh, committees, all these committees uh, are shown. The one important thing, all students, for the students, it is the industry institute registration. 
Uh, can you see mouse? Yes, sir. Uh, so it is for the industry registration. So it is not applicable to students. It's only to the recruiters. So there, there will be the data by the CITP. So this data will be received to the CITP. Second is the student's registration. It is now this link is for the 1920 plus uh, 2021. 2021 is the batch which will be leaving. So in 21, in the month of uh, April, May, June, the bat batch is leaving for them this registration link. And uh, this is for the current uh, student's registration. Where the students will be entering their data. Okay, now I have connected it to where the students will be entering to this data. Here is the electronics engineering. Since the till the date, there were the students of electronics engineering. So when you click it, where final year students, they will enter their information. It is for the electronics and ENTS engineering. It's all about the, your email ID, where you are interested, whether you are interested for the placement or higher studies or self-employment or for other if something might be there. Name of the students, roll number and all these. So this data is required for the uh, placement and even for the segregation uh, of the students for uh, employment, self-employment and for the higher studies. So that accordingly we can uh, cater. So if the students, 30, 40 students have shown interest for the higher studies, so accordingly we can cater to them. Uh, we can uh, connect to them to uh, those type of information. For the self-employment, there are the various committees, skills and develop, entrepreneurship development committees and all these. So where the students will be uh, moved and to the um, inputs will be given. And most of the students are for the placements. So 80, 90% students are uh, showing interest for the placements. So that type of, uh, uh, that type of information we are collecting. So it will be connected through the website. So this will be the website and it will be directly then linked to our college website so that directly you will go to college. Under the heading of the placements, this uh, site will be uh, seen and there you will register. So within two, three days, uh, we'll activate this site. So this is for the students' information, entering students' information. And uh, here is the two register students. Now, can you see this? The two register students' presence in of full campus placement drive. Right? Can you tell me that? You, do you see that? Uh, this? Yes, sir. Ah, so here, to register students' presence, click here. So the student will enter. Which students? Those students are appearing for drives. Sometimes they are there at COEP, suppose for the placements. They are going to COEP or they are gone to uh, DOI Petal or they are gone to some other place. Or there are drives in our institute or sometimes in the our neighbor institute, the uh, IOIT. So these students will not come to department and will not tell them that the, yes, we are going for this placement. But instead of that, directly through this link, they will enter their email ID from which department they are, the name of the students, mobile number and roll number for the sorting purpose only we have made it. Then date of placement or drive, their uh, date will be written here and name of the company for which company they are appearing and whether it's uh, in campus or off campus or full campus so accordingly they will mention here and uh, venue of in campus off campus here they will mention that yes we are there at this place. So not necessary to be at ASSMSUA only, but those are outside. Then also they have to fill up this and they will submit it. So as soon as they submit it, it comes to your faculty coordinator, department faculty coordinator, and it comes to the head of the department and to me also. And we then uh, cross check that the, yes, these students are there and then the remaining students are in the class. So for, for that purpose, this is the attendance. And in the last only, we will not be taking the student data, but it will be the live, it is the uh, live data we will be taking. So this is about the student's registration at the time of uh, placement. 
so students registration now final year students and third year students final year students they have to register right now they have to register uh, through this 2021 batch for third year i am uh, going to add this but final year students they have to register here and final year students simply maji yes maji better simply mala jayche meeting attend karaje better simply okay dekhay sir uh, okay final year students they have to register over here and one more message i had given to final year students that they register they open linkedin account and then the june end was the target given to them and july is the target for the database generation so these two are the target final year students are important to us right now so for final year students they have to Uh, group discussions and all these kind of trainings, and they have to be ready with their database. Third year students, you will be given the link, and later on only you start. The that data will be required for the internships. Second year students also, the data is required for the internships. Now internships has been launched by the AICT. They have given the guidelines that the students will go for the internships, and internship is also. the strong media to reach to the industry so as far as possible as much as possible all of you go for internships second year third year you have time final year student they are not having time but the second year third year students can go for the internships so internships and all these uh, linkages with the industry will take you to the fruitful results so we all have to work together then only the result will be a positive or as per our expectation so this all about from my side if any questions are there that i'll take up okay thank you sir uh, i think sir first we'll ask uh, yes. with anagar i'll, I'll come back to my uh, presentation yes. ah yes sir at the end we'll take the question answer session yes stop sharing anything yes now now i request uh miss miss smita nagarade madam from entc department she is our departmental coordinator of citp cell to take over the session miss smita ma'am nagarade ma'am Ma'am, please check in participant list whether she is unmute. Madam, unmute yourself. Nagarare, ma'am. Hello. Ah, ma yeah. Hello. Yes, yes, ma'am. Ah, uh, I'm there. Okay, you start your session, ma'am. You can share your PPT. Are you able to hear me? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Hello. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Are you able to hear me now? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay, thank you. Thank you, sir. I'm able. हेलो 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 यस मैम बोला यस मैम ओके फाइन आई थिंक इट इज एस सी टी एंड बी इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड ई एन टी सी स्टूडेंट्स राइट हेलो हेलो ये तो दे आर ऑल आर म्यूटेड दे आर ऑल आर म्यूटेड ओके ओके फाइन नो प्रॉब्लम अह 
हेलो ऑल आई एस एस एम एस कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड टेली कम्युनिकेशन आई एम द इंचार्ज सी आई टी पी कॉर्डिनेटर फॉर डिपार्टमेंट प्लस आई एम द इंचार्ज ऑफ इंडस्ट्री इंस्टीट्यूट इंट्रैक्शन ऑल्सो टूडे आई वॉन्टेड टू टेल यू समथिंग अबाउट प्लेसमेंट्स एज अ सी आई टी पी कॉर्डिनेटर uh i want you all to know what is certifications uh and uh, what is internship what is training and what is placement these all four aspects are being covered by vaghmare sir but still i want to tell you that he has told you some of the sites to register uh for example like he has told you to go for uh, linkedin so linkedin is one good platform for students to know number of companies available they will post you every time what they plus the job opportunities of the company on linkedin so all of then please uh, go and register yourself on linkedin uh, see my connections i do have so many connections from our college or uh, as alumni or uh, from outside our college uh, most of them are hr uh, persons uh, some of them are technical experts one of the person is a vlsi expert so i have Uh, connected through them for different reasons so all these platforms are available to you please ensure that you are registered on linkedin secondly uh, i would surely emphasize on certifications certifications issued by the proper uh, proper software uh, Uh, or uh, example model then sun important if you are going for right uh, or vishmita uh, you are not if you are, hello madam you are not properly audible okay, next uh okay is it audible yes yes ma'am yes ma'am okay okay yes ma'am uh, then there are more good uh, bandwidth is low i think uh, network bandwidth is low c is hello hello prachi madam are you able to hear me yes 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 madam yes yes madam uh, now echo me ha ha and that because of the not uh, connected connectivity problem is there yeah but it's okay i think yeah. you people are audible no. i am audible to you all hear you now we can hear you now we can hear you yeah okay fine thank you uh, um, this ma'am if you so turn i request all the students to go for certifications whatever course you are doing uh, for hardware tools and for software please go for certifications uh see those are valid certifications those are not being given by local bodies uh see that you are going to have a good certification uh this will add to your profile uh it will enhance your profile when you are going for job opportunities say for example if you are going for any interview for a company then this will be very very important for you to show them that
you do have internships also or uh, some of the things in certain groups for internships uh, Uh, there are uh, available from different companies or so company but early our internship then do register on .com. internship is a big internships uh, sometimes they do pay you uh, a very uh, a small amount of money provide you mom so all these mom. things are available on intentionshala.com yes sir lagran ma'am uh, you stop video no, no, so the no, no. Uh, stop bandwidth problem no. now so voice is not clear so you stop ha? video okay, your okay. video will, that we will okay okay. Uh, okay fine fine no problem sir yes no problem mm -hmm. then yeah then we come to training uh, most of the students do want online training but uh, nowadays uh, i mean uh, this uh, during this covid uh, 19 situation uh, online uh, workshops are being held but online training as such is not being given but there are certain platforms uh, something like audino is there uh, github is there you will find uh, so many open sources for software and hardware tools available uh, they are giving 10 days uh, workshops 10 days trainings to students some of them are paid some of them are free you can register on these sites just check it out uh, you will find so many opportunities coming out on these sites also they provide you a link for job assistance also then we come to placement in our college um, as you know the tree is like uh, principal sir then the citp head CITP coordinator, then CITP department coordinators, then CITP department coordinators do have student coordinators, and student coordinators coordinate certain things to CITP head or CITP coordinator. So overall, we are uh, having a link to go through all this process. Uh, then you have to build your resume, uh, build the resume in such a manner that it will showcase. every hardware and software skill set of yours uh build a good profile such that companies will be impressed then uh what we do in our colleges uh when students are going from third year to final year we circulate a sheet for data information and this data information is regarding your personal details your uh, education qualifications how much marks you have secured uh, from first year to your third year exams uh, average of all uh, those who are coming from direct second year for direct second year also we do have um, diploma average marks uh, we have to give them uh, the marks like uh, if in first year second year and third year then we do see sometimes the company do have a criteria that only third year marks will be taken into consideration sometimes they do take aggregate marks so sometimes the companies do take cgpas depends on uh, company criteria uh, then after collecting this data we pass on this data to the citp head and, and then the citp head line ups all the company uh, we first Uh, type of company profile it is having, what type of aptitude it is going to have. So every student who is going to go through campus placement has to acquire uh, the skills of solving to crack that aptitude. Uh, how to have good English communication skills? All these things are being seen when you are appearing for any company from college side. so citp head uh, sees the criteria what is the criteria of the company according to that criteria are eligible to go for aptitude that is also being seen and then sometimes we do have a negotiation with the companies also regarding your job placement 
so so oh, this was how in our college and i expect every student coming from second year third year and final year should cooperate with the coordinators uh say for example the second year students might not be having any idea uh, what is going on in the department right now as they are new to department so i request second year students also if you are having any difficulty or uh, regarding your courses or regarding your certifications or say you want to go for internships or trainings you can contact me directly i'm i'm available on uh, whatsapp on facebook um, and on instagram also then uh, if not possible you can directly call me my number is uh, on the website uh, you can check the website of the college you can check the website of citp go and see how many of our students got placement through our campus recruitment procedure and i want to tell you is uh of the people think uh, we want to go in software uh, uh, in because by please we teachers do both sets, hardware as well as software both the uh, if you are having both the skills then these skills are very very important for a electronics and telecommunication engineer as we are working on both hardware as well as on software some of the subjects in our curriculum are designed only for this purpose so please go through it and let me know if you are having any kind of difficulty for uh, your placements or if you want to have some guidance on which type of job you should choose for yourself where you will be fit in that also i can tell you so this is all i wanted to tell you all thank you for listening me having patience thank you all thank you vismita ma'am now we'll take the questions uh vagbade yeah. sir yes yeah. uh you both can answer the first question is which uh, i of... just went to uh, i went through chats okay uh, sir and saw that there are the questions i tell you that uh, Uh, which product yes, based companies in it sector visit our campus for recruitment this is the one uh, shivam deshmukh has uh, raised this question correct you choudhary which are the top recruiters associated with our college for entc student uh, which communication based industries visit our campus for recruitment and the uh, next question is on the for higher studies and self employment what help can we get from college which companies are top recruiters uh, <laughs> then the will our college will for foreign examinations like jre ielts i mean support so what kind of so these are the questions mostly on the top recruiters or uh, the specific kind of uh, uh, companies or uh, the help required for the higher studies or for the uh, foreign examinations like so such questions have been raised by the students so uh, i would like to uh, mention over here that the uh, recently only we have uh, decided that we should not only concentrate on placements because uh, the placements it was the uh, concept a few years before but now it has been changed totally now the buzzwords have uh, come forward those are the Uh, employability or the uh, startups or the um, entrepreneurship and all these are there and the placement or the recruitment will be declining and all these those are the unconventional those will be rising up isn't it and you will also agree with me uh, that the total scenario is changing from the uh, directly yes get me absorbed to that Yes, I am ready to absorb other people, so that kind of situation will be. So, 
our main objective is to make the student employable through the, all this technical and then the uh, the finishing kind of uh, trainings and uh, reaching towards the final as a product so that way we are thinking and uh, now when we uh, say that the uh, which are the top recruiters and all this the, so these are the list the lists are given even on the uh, website so please uh, you refer it but for the jr and ielts supports for an examination supports right now we are not giving uh, at the individual level faculties are giving uh, support but not as a formal but when the number will be substantial then we can uh, think of about the uh, this type of support otherwise students normally go on their own for these uh, special kind of uh, examinations and for the employment self employment studies and self employment what help again here when we saw that the, in the last year in 1920 batch out of the 606 650 uh, 650 students only near about 6 to 7 students those have shown or those is, uh, have shown inclination towards the self employment so we couldn't do Uh, a lot uh, to them but if the student mem student uh, numbers are substantial then certainly we can do so these were the questions apart from these questions uh, any other questions directed to me uh, and madam uh, you can unmute yourself and you can ask question sir mawle sir has asked one question what is the proposed plan of core placement in entc for academic year 2021 okay plan actually it is a joint plan mawle sir uh, the department and then the citp uh, has to work uh, uh, jointly so it is the plan of both of us uh, vismita madam do you want to answer the questions Hello, Vismita, ma'am. Would you like to answer the question? Yes, it was not seen uh, right now. I think uh, just now, uh, Maule sir has raised that question. How can we get internships? Uh, some students are asking is how to go, uh, how to approach for internship. Is mm. is, is there any facility available at uh, CITP uh, to provide internship to students? Yes, now the one part that we decided. Uh, to all the core because in our institution entc mechanical electrical uh, almost all except uh, computer science the almost all the uh, branches are the core branches so here the internship is the internships is the best way to reach to the industry so that is the one thing that we are planning so we are we are sending as much as possible as many as num as many as possible number of students for the internships and then it will be connected to uh, the placements and the students are asking is uh, the help from citp so how citp will help in internship to entc students yes yes we can we can they should come forward we are ready Yes, sir. Your voice is not clear. First, madam, your voice is not clear. Uh, for what? Companies for what? Placement for or internship companies. or training? Uh, companies for ENTC core companies for recruitment. Core companies for ENTC. yeah. There are number of companies available. A uh, few. I will name a few. Uh, one is Lear of uh, Lear Corporation. The other one, other one is Hela. 
then one is called as uh, micro uh, solutions private limited this company is in injwadi uh, this company sometimes allows students to go for internship also they do have placements also then uh, two core companies are there with us also uh, then uh, some of the it companies are having core work especially for embedded systems and vlsi design there are number of opportunities in vlsi design also and uh, in embedded systems also so some of it companies do have this section then um, uh if students want to go for uh, internships in core companies then they have to look for uh, internshala.com uh, in internshala.com also there are a uh, number of companies which are core or they can get a list of companies or if they know someone then i can give reference to students to go for internships also or to go for placements also so most of our students uh, have gone through uh, campus then from our references we do know some of the students they place uh, uh, they give their advertisement with us then we uh, give students a chance to go with all these type of things so if students wants to go for internship then uh i think they should know on which platform they want to work first thing if they know that then yes easily uh, internships are available on internshala also and uh, through different companies we know few people who do help us regarding core contents uh here somme thakur asks uh, that the how we can uh, get internships the present situation is only the online uh, online internship is the option uh, for core it is slightly less uh, opportunity but the uh, if you come forward that we are in need of such kind of trainings or in uh, in such company there we are ready to connect you okay one more question is asked how many yes i think vedant vedant play uh... yeah. Yeah, Vedant? Vedant placed a question, right? Yeah, correct. Yes, he was asking for how many months we can do internships. Yeah, correct. Officially, fifteen days. Unofficially, one month. Yes, Vedant, I answered your question. Sometimes we do consider if students are going for good internships. Unofficially. Yes. Any other questions? Yes. So I think all questions are answered. Okay. Uh, so uh, thank you uh, so much, uh, Bagmare, uh, Dr. Bagmare sir, for highlighting the activities CITP cell conducts for the students. Thank you so much, sir, for sparing your valuable time with us. Uh, i would like to thank uh, vismita nagrade madam for guiding all the students to how to prepare themselves for the uh, competition exams uh, or for the companies various companies uh, thank you so much so i conclude that the, the today's sessions are over so please join tomorrow for the tomorrow's sessions thank you so much thank you thank you madam
please stop the YouTube link. Who's streaming? Then lose the meeting. They end the meeting later on.